How to create a new Apple ID and safely remove the old one. Start by creating your new Apple ID. Go to iCloud, click Sign In, and tap Create Apple Account. Fill in your name and birth date, then register a new email address. It's important not to reuse your old one. After verifying the email and phone number with the confirmation code, you get a new Apple ID. Before signing out of your old account, ensure that you transfer your essential data. Log into iCloud.com on your computer. For contacts and calendars, select the data you need, and export it as a vCard. Then, import this file to your new account. For photos, use shared albums to move them from your old account to the new one. Notes and reminders can be shared individually or forwarded by email. Just remember, apps and subscriptions won't transfer, you'll need to repurchase them under the new account. Once your data is safe, go to Settings, tap your account name, scroll down, and tap Sign Out. Choose whether to keep a copy of your iCloud data. If you want to delete the old Apple ID permanently, visit privacy.apple.com, sign in with the old credentials, and request account deletion. You'll verify your identity, note down the access code, and confirm. Apple applies a 7-day waiting period before deleting everything tied to that account, after that, there's no going back. But if you're stuck and can't remember the old password, or if your device is still linked to the old Apple ID, MagPhone iPhone Unlocker can help remove it without needing the password. If Find My is turned off, removal is instant. If it's on, you'll need to verify your screen passcode, download the firmware, and click unlock. This lets you bypass the disabled account without entering the password.